welcome to the next part of the programme. And here we have Maureen Walshin, who will be playing oboe to recording of Frogs. Well, I was originally wanting to do this uh, live, so to speak, down at the creek down here in Faversham with the live marsh frogs, but they're very uncooperative and uh, when they uh, want to appear. So instead, we have a recording of North American marsh frogs, which Maureen will now play too. We have seen several kinds of frogs often fall in the same pond. The composition of individual choruses not only varies with the habitat, but with the region. Some sort of choruses are real estate. One of the choruses in Tucson, Arizona, followed in the summer rain, is composed of the Colorado River Toad, the Great Plains Toad, Couch's Spade Foot, and the Western Spade Foot. This is totally different from a chorus in Rodeo, New Mexico, with the plain spade foot and the western spade foot. south of Brighton, Florida, the green tree frog, feeding in company with the little grass frog, but with a crawl of a small chorus frog, Sudacris nigrita vinicosa constituents. Its voice sounds like someone running his fingers over the teeth of a comb. are sometimes confused by the presence of insects in the sounds made by the of the frogs. In the Waha River near Arnold Springs, Florida, tree crickets outnumber the frogs, the green frogs, the green tree frog, the squirrel tree frog, and the eastern narrowmouth toad, the jaw-like call of the river frog, Ramahectory, are all to be heard sometimes on the opposite side of the river. surpass the number of species that recorded near the Archbold Bay of the state of Orange County, Florida. This is a chorus that we dissected earlier with 11 species calling, but with a barking tree frog out there in the area. Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you, Maureen. <laughs>
Hello, Tim. I'm in Berlin. Where are you? We have to go to the library and we have to read all those books. Everybody should read all those books. Read them fast. Read them slow. 
Read them in any language you understand. Tim, do you understand me? Where are you? Tim, where are you? Read these books. Shall I read them for you? I can read them only in my language. So coming up next, we have a beautiful duo with the magical Maggie Nichols and Mopomoso's very own Tim Fletcher. Tim is playing an enchanting little crackle box that mimics some of Maggie's crackle singing very beautifully. And we have a full force Maggie in this video, including the incredible poetry and tap dancing that she sometimes brings. And something that I notice is that it seems that this day was a red day. And something that I've been trying to do for years is to memorize the numerology color system of Maggie Nichols. And if I remember correctly, a red day means that it was numerology one that day. Anyway, I hope you enjoy. That was bloody brilliant. <laughs> oh, I like a good old belly laugh. No. <laughs> <laughs> and excited by this journey I'm on. <gasps> I don't want to go on my own, but I don't want to be swallowed up either. Can we be in our different rhythms together, centered in fire, with the right to be clumsy, cliched and tired? <laughs> Clumsiness is an essential part of grace. Oh no, not another fear to face or dance around and avoid in what my mate Sherl calls a void dance, <laughs> a dancing void. It's a skip and a stumble, a flip and a fall, a trip and a stumble, a dip and a crawl. But like Dorothy said, we're coming to call. This is a break dance down and through to fly anew. But don't forget your roots in the underbelly ground. dance of dissidence, dissonance, a dizzying dance of contradiction in the here and not here, always moving, the same and not the same, continuity and interruption. Altered states are natural, anyone can experience them, but being pushed over the edge by those who deny, classify and pathologize can tip you over the edge and spin you around in vicious circles of loneliness and despair. Kindred spirits betrayed, solidarity frayed. Are you an angel from heaven come to prostitute me? Oh, hey. <laughs> I we you he she they I we you he she they I we I we I wish you were here in this journey of musical metaphor and more ah, flesh blood 
bones stripped bare to the essential soul energy of staying alive and human constantly changing in the face of orders to stay the same, fixed and framed in a state of imposed surrender. No to the grindstone, know your place, no escape, scapegoat all those who cannot, will not fit, even into the margins. <laughs> Isolate, dislocate, medicate, they're finding new disorders every day. It could be you. <laughs> Capitalism needs efficient, cheap and cheerful labour. <laughs> oh, 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 let me sleep through this. I don't want to go on this journey. I, 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 I'll just wake up every now and then and scream obscenities at the telly, but not too loud in case the neighbours hear me and suss I'm mad. Oh, I'm a of Hecate, Hecate, be my guide on this journey of constant becoming. Lady of the Crossroads, Mother of the Witches. Ay, 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 ay. Journey woman of death, change, giving birth, an altered state, protector of the innocent and the man. Take me to the heart of the beast and show me courage I, I didn't know I had. Oh, yeah, my yeah, Ooh, yeah. Ah, show me that we can, within the limits of our epoch, gather our resources, summon up the forces of freedom and change, make a nuisance of ourselves, to make a new sense of ourselves. Like a mighty river on the go, bubbling with contradiction. I block and hide, stem the tide, and so much paranoia deep inside, begging for benediction. Spout and spin, full to the brim, wanting to reach every her and him in creative communication. Oh, Can I stem the tide? Think. Stop and start. Stop and start. Stop and start fighting heart thinking. They want me to fall apart. <laughs> oh, drowning in desperation. Letting the beast out more and more. Acting for liberation. Hedge and fudge. Oh, please don't judge. I'm a really sweet, harmless wee girl. I won't bear a grudge. It's being boring, but it's, for me, balance is like being on a bloody tightrope, you know. It's never, it's never fixed. It's always kind of like, oh, goodness almighty, what's going to happen next? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So these swings, these swings, exhausting, absolutely exhausting, thrilling at times, but bloody depressing at other times. Oh, 
for me, my boy. Centered and strong in a journeying song, learning to trust my own right and wrong, dancing the contradiction of Russia. <laughs> Next up is a really gorgeous piece. It's by Merve Salgar, who plays tambour, and Anul Eraslan, who plays cello. And they live between Germany and Istanbul. Their musical practices are right on the edge of traditional and improvised music. Merve also does new composition for ancient instruments and has a more classical repertoire as well. Anul his career as a cellist leads him from Anatolian music to free music. And he's also working on a documentary about the Istanbul improv scene, which I, for one, will be very interested to see. Hope you enjoy it. Thank you. 